How do we know when Canada's gun control laws are created to secure our lives and not simply our votes? My name is Claire and I am currently working as a research assistant in the political science department with Dr. Noah Schwartz on a project regarding, regarding policy evaluation. The project aims to evaluate the implementation and enforcement of recent changes to gun control laws in Canada. Among the laws examined are recent policies that have led to the prohibition of 1,500 models of assault-style firearms, as well as a nationwide handgun freeze. Unlike most evaluations of Canadian firearms policy, which rely on quantitative analysis to gauge the effects of gun control laws, this project is using qualitative data. Instead of exclusively using statistics and numbers to determine the effectiveness of policies, human participants such as law enforcement officers, civil servants, hunters in rural and indigenous communities, community workers, including individuals with past affiliations with gangs, and others involved in the enforcement and administration of Canada's gun laws are being interviewed. Literature, including media reports, government documents, and court decisions are also being reviewed to thoroughly evaluate policies. Findings and evaluations of the firearms policies that are addressed in the interviews and literature will be determined through the process of thematic analysis to draw out key themes and patterns that emerge from the data set. The patterns analyzed through this process will then be used to create policy recommendations. The logic behind a policy, the evidence in support of it, and the harms caused by the policy will be examined. Ultimately, this project aims to contribute to the understanding of how to build gun control policies in Canada that are safe, fair, and effective. Thank you.